General Services Agency, the company handling the Guam Regional Mass Transit Authority's procurement for bus services, has recommended to the GRTA board that they proceed with phase two of its bidding process, despite a protest from the only bidder, Kloppenberg Enterprises. This is according to Brad Kloppenberg, Vice President of Business Development for Kloppenberg Enterprises. KEI, the sole bidder for the services, filed a protest after their initial bid was rejected by GRTA. Now, GSA says that the protest has merit and GRTA should move ahead with Phase 2. Earlier on mornings with Patty Arroyo and K57, KEI President Bruce Kloppenberg said that once GRTA requests pricing, KEI will begin to move forward. There has been a concern on the way Guam's mass transit is being handled with KEI operating the system on short-term, month-to-month contracts. According to Kloppenberg, this recent news offers a possible long-term solution to a fledgling mass transit system. And it's always been, it's always been an issue of funding. Okay? If the political will is there to fund the mass transit properly, uh, then, then yeah, absolutely. You can listen to the full interview on our website at pacificnewscenter.com.